What's going on guys, Ozzy here, welcome back to a brand new video, so today we have the Inform Mane 90 rated, I'm pretty sure it's the second Inform, 670k, that's a lot for a single Inform I must say, now 5 foot 9 he is the meta height, but let's look at the base stat card first, 96 pace, 90 dribbling, 86 shooting, 81 passing, 77 physical, now them stats look insane, what I've noticed from this card, though, that I checked, he hasn't got the finesse trait or outside foot trait. Bit of a problem saying that they are overpowered this year. Now, high medium work rates for a left mid. I would say it's up there, but for probably a left... If you're going to use this card left mid and not striker, I would prefer a left mid to have high high. But if you're going to use him up front, then high medium is literally perfect. Now, right foot, left foot, it doesn't matter. Four star weak foot. Four star weak foot is the minimum I should usually go. He's got it, like... Five star weak foot is a bit over the top. I would say it's not necessary, but it's always nice to have. Now, four star skills. Four star skills, obviously, yeah, again, the minimum I'll go on skill moves. He's going to be able to do the burrow spins and stuff, and hopefully he feels nice. Now, I am using a marksman on him. He is on 10 chemistry, obviously. 97 acceleration, 94 sprint speed. This guy is fast. He's going to be running past people like there's no tomorrow. Now, 99 finishing, 92 shot power, 89 long shots, 87 volleys. He's got that 98 attack and positioning. So I'm expecting him to do them cheeky runs, in, but not maybe in behind at some points. Probably come short sometimes as well. But 99 finishing with 92 shot power, I must say, he's going to be finishing shots, hopefully. Now, 85 short passing is really nice because obviously you can do them one twos and stuff 74 long passing is not terrible I would say 75 minimum but 74 is not that much of a big difference 99 agility 97 reaction 93 ball control 96 dribbling There's nothing else to say about that this guy's gonna feel agile as hell He's gonna be able to move really fast. He's gonna be able to do them little one twos I'll be able to drip inside out with players hopefully now 99 jumping for a 5 foot 9 player is actually really really weird but I doubt he's going to be winning headers if he does hey that's just a plus I guess but 88 stamina what can I say with that pace you need stamina I must say and he's got it so he's going to be running throughout the whole game which is always nice to have 74 strength 83 aggression that aggression is really really nice the strength not that much but I feel like this card's going to be so far so agile that you're not going to really need that much strength. He's going to be getting away from opponents easily. Now, I have linked him up with, obviously, Nabikata and Turney. Just to get him on full cam. I will be using him in a 4-4-2. I'll put him up front. Then I'll use him in a 4-2-3-1. And then I'll use him Lamb and see how that works out. But let's get straight into the games. Oh, my God. He was in. I just mistimed it. What a run, by the way. That, was, that wasn't manually. Like, I didn't tell him to make a run. He just did that automatically. That's quite impressive. I actually haven't seen that. He's got a mad run all the way up here. That was nice positioning from What a touch. What a turn. Oh, just got tackled. That was a really nice touch though, I must say. I could have probably did something else different there. Mane coming short. I like that. Just got a normal fake shot. Go around the corner. Nice turn. No one is supporting him, though. Look at this. Go on, go for the finesse. Oh, my God. It's a beautiful shot, I must say, to a guy that doesn't actually have a finesse shot trait. He can finesse that. Jesus Christ. That went straight top bin. So, I'm going to take another look at that. Let's see this. Look at it. Guy didn't come towards me. And he's absolutely rifled it at the top of the net. Money. No, he had that acceleration. He had the sprint speed on. I was about to fake sure around the corner. Then it probably would have been a ball roll. And then it would have been a goal. But let's try something out real quick. This has been patched since the new update. And it's annoying me like hell. But let's try it. Why not? Not a greatest touch. But you see how it full pelts the ball towards him. Like I'm not expecting him to take a good touch. I'm expecting like too many years to take probably a better touch there. Why not go for the finesse again? Ooh, this one was a bit further out, obviously. It didn't go as high. I didn't put as much power into it, I feel like. Ref. 
come on now, behave, behave. Well, let's try out Mane's penalties. Right. So, I'm going to try this tactic, okay? Okay, all right. Never try this tactic ever again, boys. Nice. <clears throat> One, two. Play that ball, can you? Nice. Just going to RBX this, hopefully. It goes all the way to Lewandowski. That's a save and a half, to be fair. Beautiful play. Can you finish it? Yes, you can. Not, that's a really, really nice play. I just obviously switched it, but I did it slowly. So Mane could make that little run there. I must say, what a finish. What a ball. Standing still as well. Just going to chip it. I'm just going to chip it. Oh, when did I go cocky? Mane. Why not? I have a dig. Oh! I honestly thought that was in. Hitting the outside of the post like that, Mane. Okay, okay. Use that pace. Come on. Use the pace. There you go. Can I act like I'm going to cut back? Oh, my. Okay, I didn't expect him to actually get that ball, so I wasn't prepared for what to do next. I thought he lost it, but somehow, some way, he managed. Hill to hill. Left foot. Ooh, it wasn't the most powerful shot, I must say. I feel like if that was on his right foot, it would have been a full pelter. Morning. Just play that ball. Lewandowski uses the wrong foot. If he used the right foot there, it's a goal, 100%. It was a nice pass, I guess. Mane got into position just to support me. Once again, Mane just coming there to support me. You, look at this. People say he ain't got strength. But look what I'm looking at. That's a nice run. Little sweat. Why not? Give Mane the little goal. He's there for the position. He's there to support. I can't say anything bad. Ooh. Go on. Mane on the sticks. Oh my god, the guy's sending players for a hot dog. But you can obviously see how agile this guy is. And Messi kind of scores that. God knows how he scored that. But you see how agile Mane is. I'm just literally, that's with the stick. I'm not doing anything else. Little one-twos. We're just going to run because I know he's got enough pace. There's no doubt. Going to act like I'm going to cut in. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Now, right there is when the outside foot trait comes into play. If he had the outside foot trait, that's a goal. 100%. Oh, sharp turns. What a pass. Okay, I didn't actually think that pass would actually, like make it because of the pace. But it was very, very nice just to get off Lewandowski's foot and quick finish. You know Lewandowski. If you guys missed a player review, the link will be in the description. Trust me, you want to watch this. Oh, quick turn. Quick fake shot, maybe? Double ball roll. Just to get the angle. Oh, come on, man. Where's the finish? I said, why not? I said, why not? If you're not coming towards me, I'm going to do my little thing. You know what I'm saying? What a finish. What a volley. What a goal. Nadolski. What a can you swing it? <laughs> the beautiful pass. Well elevated and everything. The fake shot into the space. It's a beautiful finish, I must say. He feels very, very agile. Them little fake shots, they're so beautiful with him. I can't really say anything else. This guy's going to rage quit. Bye-bye. Can you make that pass? It's going to be a stretch, but he did make it. Lewandowski, Messi, take a touch, do the little, do your little trickery, you know you're going to turn him, you know you are, Mane, fake shot, well, I expected that fake shot a bit more angled towards the goal, it obviously didn't do it, I did the first time shot, it wasn't even that bad of a shot to be fair, at that angle, I'm expecting it to go much more weaker, nice, fake shot around the corner if you can, and again, full roll in, Finesse, oh, it's beautiful footwork, but he just can't get the shot. Why not bang it? Oh, my God. I don't know what went through my head to bang that, but somewhat, somehow, he's hit, managed to hit the post. Fake shot. 
Oh, he used his strength, the body of Ferreira, which uh, you don't see a lot, I'm not going to lie. And then, oh, he just took a bad touch after that. I was going to sweat it to Messi. Come on. <laughs> I don't know how he managed to get around Nesta, I must say. I did the skill move just to get the angle for the finesse. And I'm not going to lie, oh, he's getting a bit close to the camera there, didn't he? This is a finish and a half. I thought this was going to be blocked by that play by the defender. But somehow, some way, Mane has managed to get around the goalkeeper, around the defender, to hit post and in. It's a beautiful finish. What a finish. It started even lagging there a little bit, which was a bit concerning. But what a finish. Usually, you need the outside foot trait to finish this. But he did well to get it over the keeper and then obviously lobbed it in. He let it go over. He's done really well and obviously it's going to be an AI block to the... Oh, it's just annoying, but what a turn, I must say. Oh, that's a pass. Nice patient play just to get the little goal. What a pass from Mane. So it's time to review him and let me just say straight off the back, he scored seven goals in three games. Now I'm taking into account that he is 670k. So this guy is clearly, clearly not cheap. He only got one assist, which surprises me because he I think it was the pass before the assist most of the time. Now, let's go over his stats one more time. Five foot nine, the meta height, high medium. I personally think it was perfect. I liked him at striker a lot, but at Lamb he was insane. Like the pace that he was getting down there, the fact that he can dribble like a god and he can shoot like a god is a lot into account. Now he is by footed, four star weak foot. I did see that weak foot coming to play. Sometimes it wasn't the most powerful shot, but some other times it was actually a pretty decent shot. Now, four-star skills. I like the four-star skills because I saw the Burbs being coming to play quite a bit. Now, his pace, amazing. His pace was crazy. Feels really, really fast. Now, he's finishing. I did see that coming to play a lot. He was finishing most of his shots, but at some point I did give him hard angles. And I really wanted to test out his shooting to see what angles... This guy could probably score, right? Because obviously, you know, team of the year. Team of the year comes out and all of a sudden, the team of the year cards can score at, like, the most disgusting angles you'll ever see. So, I'll, obviously, I'm trying out everyone's finishing. See what happens. Now, he's short passing. I did see that short passing come into play. He even did a little cheeky back heel. That was a beautiful goal that I just hit across the Lewandowski. I must say, his dribbling was insane. He's dribbling. He has these little, little touches that he does. That I don't know what I can say about it. He just he just has these little touches that you can get around every single corner. All I do, because I know a lot of people ask about dribbling. All I do for me to dribble is just I use the left analog stick. That's all I do. I don't touch anything else. Uh, people, Some people touch LB. Some people touch RB and all this stuff. I don't. I just literally move the analog stick and it works perfectly. Now, what surprised me a lot was his stamina. Now, I have got players that have a lot of stamina in my team, but Mane was running the whole game, running beautiful, uh, like, coming short a lot. He was such a good player, it was ridiculous. And in the 75th minute, he still had, like, three quarters of his bar on stamina. I was so surprised because this allows him to pretty much get in behind so much more often because the left back and right back are working up and down, up and down. So... Mane is just going to abuse that when he's going down the wing. Now, what surprised me a lot was his strength and aggression. His strength and aggression came into play and his strength was good. It wasn't bad and it wasn't 74 strength. I can tell you that right now. It came into the 80 strength. He really wanted to get in front of his man, be aggressive, fighting for the badge. I enjoyed it a lot, I must say. But I have to give this card a rating out of 10 and I'm going to give him... A 9 out of 10, no doubt. This card was amazing. Now, the reason he doesn't get a 10 out of 10 is simply because he hasn't got 5-star skill. If he had 5-star skill, the flip flap with this card, the things I'll do with this card, I wouldn't be allowed to say on YouTube. That's all I'm going to say. Now, 670k is a lot for a player, but if you have the coins, go pick them up, please. But if you guys did enjoy this player review, leave a like, leave a comment, and for now... Peace.